Hello everyone, my name is Yellow and today I'm testing Cyberpunk with the new DLSS 3.5, the array reconstruction thing, you know. I will test it first at 1080p with the settings, everything on maximum and the path tracing. Wait a second, it's down here. Yes, sir. Oh, I disabled it for some reason. Okay. And um, yeah, I will test it with DLSS on quality and I will also test it with frame generation. But yeah, let's go into the game and see how it runs. Are you tired about the Windows activation message? Scroll down to the description and click on the first link. You can get the Windows key for as low as 8 euros and 99 cents and use the code GAMESUP for 10% off and get activated in seconds. So guys, this is not any TP with DLSS on balanced, as you guys can see. I will also test DLSS on quality and then what is that? Do you guys see that? On the ground? What the hell? <coughs> I will also test it next with um, DLSS on quality also and frame generation with both of these presets. Only balance and quality, I think the other ones, maybe on, on, on 4K, but I'm not even gonna test them on 4K. I think, I don't know, I, I don't think it makes a lot of sense. But yeah, let's see how it runs. For now, we are able to get 88 frames, 90 frames, I mean an average of 83 to be more, more honest. Sometimes here it drops a little bit, uh, it dropped a little bit back there, but now it's actually going up. Let's go. Not so bad actually, the RTX 48 is not even at, oh, it's not even at uh, um, max usage actually. I don't remember if frame generation would actually make it more, being more used, I, I don't remember. Let's, let's see it now actually. So guys, this is not any TP, DLSS on balanced and frame generation on. Let's see how it goes. So, the GPU actually is being used a little bit more, as you guys can see, which is normal because, like, it's actually creating fake frames. Let's, let's place it like that. It's not, <coughs> sorry, it's not really fake frames because they exist, but, you know what I mean? And look at the ghosting on that card. Do, do you see that, guys? Look. Oh, but I think it's because of the lights, to be honest, though. Let's see. Let's come a little bit closer here. Oh, look, look at that. Can you guys see that ghosting? I can see a lot of ghosting. When I'm closer, it, do it doesn't happen much, but I for sure can still see it though. Just not as much. Damn. Can I shoot? It <laughs> doesn't work for some reason. Okay. <coughs> I don't even know where this thing takes me though. Let's maybe go down here. Back to the city. I, I think the city is a little bit more demanding. So guys, this is now uh, 1080p DLSS on quality with, uh, with of course the ray reconstruction thing. And as you can see, like we can get now 88 frames, which is not so bad, actually. Frame generation will actually help a lot. I might also do a video like I'm going to do with the 4080, of course. This one I'm going to do with the 4070 and I'm going to do it with the 3060. Like, can the, can the 3060 do f uh, ray re reconstruction? I think it can, right? I think the 30 series always do. And what about the 20 series? I have like a 2060, but I mean, if it works, like, is it even worth it, you know? Like, because you can't even use frame generation with those cards, which is annoying as hell, not gonna lie. I think frame generation should be like for any RTX, but you know, NVIDIA things, NVIDIA things. <coughs> I, I get that they are like the dominant, let's say, brand for GPUs, but come on, bro. You, you, you don't gotta do that. <laughs> so guys, this is now 1080p, DLSS on quality, ray reconstruction and frame generation. Bro, if they keep adding stuff like this, bro, I'm like, in the start of each, of each settings that I record, I'm going to have to say like 10 things, bro, not gonna lie. The next time they, they are going to come with some new DLSS stuff or whatever. <laughs> Damn, bro. I'm actually also looking forward to the... Um, to the new AMD thing that they are, they are going to release. The um, bro, I, I forgot the name, but it was like a crazy name. Hyper something, like... Or is, maybe I'm... But you, you, you guys know what I mean. RX Hyper something like that. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, to be honest. But yeah, game still runs really fine. I think the, not the problem, but I think the um, challenge will be 2K and 4K, more more in the 4K, I think 2K, even with only the LSS on quality, I think we should be able to get at least 60 frames or more than that, so. So guys, this is now 2K, uh, ray reconstruction with DLSS on uh, balanced, let's see how it goes, for now we can get 73 frames, as I thought, as I said, like, maybe with DLSS on quality it will be closer to 60, as I said. Oh, man, I'm too good at this, come on. <laughs> just kidding, just kidding. But yeah, actually working really well. 
Uh, and, and of course, this is path tracing too. Like I, I always forget to say it because, bro, like there's so many things though. But <laughs> you know what I mean. But yeah, uh, and and I remember. I think the last time I tested path tracing with the 4080 without like this new uh, NVIDIA thing, the um, bro, it's so many names <laughs> without the <laughs> ray reconstruction. I think we had a lot less frames. So this actually, this ray reconstruction actually does a good thing. Don't ask me what it does. I don't know the like the technique things, but I know it makes the ray tracing like run smoother. Like, I don't know if it if it if it makes it like run wor um, look a little bit worse, but it makes it run better. So that's a good thing. So guys, this is now 2K uh, fr <laughs> frame generation DLSS unbalanced and ray reconstruction. I'm I'm not gonna say ray re reconstruction again. You you guys already know this is ray re <laughs> reconstruction. So. <laughs> Bro, get out of the way, come on. <laughs> come on, bro. Damn, this car actually looks good. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. As I said before, a lot of times I had COVID like recently. Um, I was good though, not gonna lie. It didn't like affect me. I still went out to like run and train, so. Yeah, by the way, I run and train, so it's my thing. I do calisthenics. I don't know if you guys know what it is, but yeah. I really love doing it. So yeah, performance actually is very nice. Um, I really want to see uh, with LSS on quality and really, really want to see with 4K because this card is also designed for 4K. Actually, and the 4090, I really want to, to see how it how it goes. I don't have it, so I guess I'll, I will, I'll have to see like from another channel. But yeah. So guys, this is now 2K, the LSS on quality uh, without frame generation. And as I said, look at that. 64 frames, I think it's the 60 to 60. Will it go down from 60 though? Uh, I don't think so. I don't think so. Okay, I mean, there should be some areas maybe if you are fighting that it should go down. Maybe I don't know. I think driving is one of the most uh, um, <coughs> demanding things in this game. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, let me let me try it actually. Let me leave the car. Don't run me over though. Let's see. Yeah, I don't think it's that bad. Maybe <coughs> if there is actually like things shooting me too though, but I don't know. So ghosting, there's still a lot of ghosting. Do, do you see there? There's still a lot of ghosting, even on 2K though. Look, look at that. D do you guys see it? On the cars like in front? I think it's because of the right racing thing though. So guys, this is now 2K, frame reconstruction, DLSS on quality and frame generation on. So now, yeah, like frame generation really saves the day, not gonna lie. Frame ge generation is crazy. I think it's one of the best things they ever released, to be honest. Some people hate it. I don't hate it. I like it. Not gonna lie. Makes games like run so much smoother, though. For me, it's worth it, though. For me, it's worth it. But yeah. GPU is basically not... Uh, actually, the GPU is not being maxed out, which is weird. Because like 1080p, the consumption was like kind of the same. Power is normal, I guess. Like, I, I I don't even think the power is being ma maxed out. What was the max power of this card? I don't actually remember though. VRAM we are using a little bit more than 1080p. Not something crazy though. Like I think we were using like 9. Dot something. Now we are using like uh, 10.5. So yeah, not not something crazy. So guys, this is now 4K. Um, oh, look at that car. 4K, uh, DLSS unbalanced, fr uh, without frame generation this time. Of course, frame re reconstruction is... Uh, ray reconstruction, I mean, is on. And yeah, right here we, we already see like some problems, though. We, are, we already see... <coughs> sorry, we already see on the 40 frames. We, we are not able to get 60. Is it playable? Yes, I guess it's playable. But uh, I, I don't think it's worth it. Like, oh, like of course, if you are going to do this, you are going to go with um, may maybe even a lower DLSS, which I don't like to use like performance and ultra performance, to be honest. Like, in my opinion. Especially with these cards, though. Like, if you have these cards, you know. Just activate frame, frame generation, you will be fine. And um, yeah, that's it, basically. I would probably do like f uh, DLSS on quality and frame generation. I don't know how, uh, how it will perform in 4K, but I'm pretty sure that's what I would use if I had like a 4K monitor. I have a 2K monitor, so yeah. So guys, this is now DLSS on balanced, 4K, and uh, frame generation on, rare reconstruction on also. 
And yeah, maybe, like I said, the DLSS quality before, uh, I think it will, will be the thing that I will be using, but actually, from the looks of it, like, we already got 60-something frames, so maybe... Bro! <laughs> okay, maybe, um, yeah, maybe DLSS on balance is the, is the goal here. Even if, if you go... and you can even go lower, though, if you, if you actually want it. Maybe, like, it's worth it. I just... I don't know, I don't need... I don't have the need to use it normally, so... Yeah. But yeah, 60 something frames. Yeah, frame ge generation really helps though. Look at the VRAM usage too, it went up a little bit. Actually, quite a bit though. <coughs> okay. Let's turn here. I'm just doing the same thing over and over probably, but yeah, I just want to test it around here while I'm driving. What happened to that car though? So guys, this is now 4K DLSS on quality, ray reconstruction on, and uh, um, frame generation off. Oh, look at that car. Should I get it? <coughs> wait, 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 wait. Sorry. Nah, it's going to run now. Bro, don't do that. Come on. No, 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 no. You're good, you're good, you're good, you're good, good. Nah. Bro, come on. I just want that car. Come back. Let's go. Is he still there? Yeah, he's right here. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Is it faster though? Maybe not. <laughs> but yeah, like, DLSS on quality is not the thing. Why, why can't I open the car though? Okay, now it worked. Sorry, bro. Really had to, to get the car. Okay, it's nice, it's nice. Looks good though, the r reflections with the ray tracing thing. So guys, this is now uh, 4K with uh, DLSS on quality and frame generation on, ray reconstruction on also, of course. And bro, I don't know if I'm wrong, but maybe it's just this car, bro. This car like looks like, like, look at this. It's like, does like very strong uh, starts and very strong like stops, you know what I mean? <laughs> but yeah, I thought it was the because of the frame time, but actually like the frame time is okay. Okay, let's go. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. But yeah, performance like this, as I said, like, <coughs> I said maybe DLSS on quality with frame generation, but actually not. I would go really with balanced here. Not that quality is not good, but like it's not 60 frames. Most people want 60 frames. It's more than playable, to be honest, with 52 frames here, but yeah. I I'm pretty sure there are like some areas that it will be a little bit lower frames, so yeah. Maybe the LSS on balance will, will be the goal. But yeah, guys, this is the end of the video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. I will do a video about this with other cards too. 40, 70, maybe the 30, 60. The 20, 60, I don't know. But yeah, let's see. It depends on how the 30, 60 goes, I guess. <laughs> but yeah, guys, leave a like on the video. Subscribe to, to my channel. really means a lot. And yeah, I'll see you on the next one. Thank you so much for watching.